Hello there, I'm Josh, this is Alex, we are the target audience. Content is made for absolutely everybody, but we think it's specifically made for us, and hopefully for you as well. Today we are finishing season two of HBO's Barry. Uh, it's been a long journey through the first two seasons for us. Rewatch for me, I watched it when the series very first came out, so a lot of details coming back to me in this rewatch. This is Alex's first time watching the show, and after this we'll finally be able to get caught up and watch the brand new season that has been uh, premiering over the last couple of months. So uh, I, as much as I'm excited for these episodes and this reaction is going to be great, I'm really excited once we get to the third season, but as far as now whole bunch of stories going on in this season to wrap up here alex after the crazy two episodes we just watched what are you looking forward to in these two uh, i don't know man uh season two episode five was probably my favorite episode of the whole show ever that episode was nuts i, I literally rewatched our reaction to it and then like i, <laughs> I, I was I, I was on cloud and it was great it was wonderful but what i'm looking forward to I, this episode's called the audition so maybe barry finally starts you know putting his acting skills to work and goes on his first audition maybe and to get a, an agent or whatever so that'll be neat to see uh i'm i'm worried about fucking fuchs man him you know finding the body and how that's gonna in, how that's gonna affect barry's acting career if he tells gene oh it's, this could be ugly this could be ugly yeah and the craziest part is on top of everything you just said, there's still, like, at least three other storyline threads out there. <laughs> you know, uh, Hank, Sally, just all this stuff going on. So, we're going to jump into it. Um, if it's your first time here, make sure to subscribe to the channel. In addition to this, we're also currently watching Star Trek, the original series from the 60s, Star Wars, the Clone Wars, as well as Obi-Wan Kenobi, the current Star Wars series on Disney+. Plus. So, we do some old stuff, we do some new stuff, and we do some movies occasionally as well. So, subscribe, become part of the target audience. Are you a client here? Oh, no. No, uh, my girlfriend is Sally Reed. Oh, you're Barry Block? How tall are you? You just get an agent audition. Thank you. Wow, thank you. Okay, cool. Hey. hey! Hey! And please don't tell me she's going to be jealous that he gets an audition because she's been trying for so long. Were you just talking to Michael? Is that his name, the guy with the ball? Hmm. Michael? Yeah, no, he was super nice. Yeah, he just got me an audition. What? I knew it! <laughs> <laughs> and I like how he like introduced himself and then he's like, Michael, is that his name? Like he doesn't even care. <laughs> I mean, Michael is Lindsay's boss. Michael. Michael. <laughs> he still doesn't remember. The man. <laughs> oh, right. Yeah, he gave me his card. Michael. <laughs> you say, oh, we're just a bunch of swim instructors. That's the title. <laughs> they can't cut that. <laughs> Suicide Squad vibes. Payback ladies. Yeah. Payback ladies. Payback ladies. You'd be this one. <laughs> uh... Do you not want to be a lead in a TV show? Not that TV show, no. When is your audition? Uh, it is tomorrow at 10 a.m. with the casting director. Oh. Jones. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, and it's great what you're doing is... I'm terrified, okay? Because my piece is real. It's not a character, it's me. Remember all those times where Barry helped you during your auditions, uh, Sally? Yeah, she doesn't you remember that? I'm afraid that they're gonna judge me, and I, I'm afraid that Sam's gonna find out and, and, and do something crazy, but what are we saying about women? I mean, this is just my story. Oh my god. And I have been doing this for way longer, and I made you. Oh, fuck off. They write me anymore after what I said in there today, but still, at least it held my ground because I am an artist, okay? An artist, and this is not fucking... So, is he still there? <laughs> I mean, to be honest, of course, I'm so happy for you. I mean... I'm... It's an impressive monologue. The actor's doing a great job. But I need you to know that if you do get it, it's gonna make me, like, like a hundred times more insane. Oh, way to, you know, manipulate your partner. Like, oh, if you get this, you know, hey, you're gonna make things worse for me. You want a little... <laughs> <laughs> he just jumps back into it. <laughs> Way to go, Barry. Way to go. D don't let her hold you down. Okay. What? Jesus. This is it. Oh, yeah, this is it. Let's kill us all. He's just accepting it. Before we die, I have to come clean. Ah, they've been setting this guy up to be the, you know, the, the leader. Mm -hmm. The tough guy. He's going to save him. Go on, Kevin, and make you delicious appetizers. Wouldn't that be something, guys? Guys? Is, is it anyone to help him? Straight up gang shootout. Oh 
Oh my god. <laughs> he just pulled him out. Kazan, well, well, well. The musical trait. Oh shit. What happens to cowards like you? Okay, seriously, I was right about to do that. He's in charge now. Yep. Honestly, though, it's like, okay, this is the out you need, you know? It's like, they're not gonna kill you. Like, they don't care. Like, do you even want to be in this business? <laughs> yeah. Although, I guess it's like, a, how do you start? How do you just, like, start a life? <laughs> but Yeah, that, that too. This is it, Sally. I'm headed up to my cabin. This private detective approached me. Hold on, he wants to talk to you. Barry. Oh! oh. Pukes, I'll go back to Cleveland. I'll, I'll kill again. I'll do whatever you want to do. Just please, please don't hurt Mr. Cooper. Shut up. <laughs> ah! No! Do you want to do the second scene? Oh, oh. I mean, I was going to say, like, why even do the audition still? He did not give a fuck. No. <laughs> <laughs> yes, lovely. Country out here. Now just fall down this mountain with me. <laughs> it's her car, okay? Uh, imagine the body decomposing there. Oh. Oh. My name is Jean Cousinow, and I killed her, and I just couldn't live with it. No! Oh, fuck you! <laughs> oh, my God. Maybe he's never Fuch even, like, killed someone before. I was, I was just thinking that Fuchs isn't a killer, so he couldn't do it, maybe? Oh, God. Just faced with the consequences of it. What was that? Gene was huddled up to the side of the car. He, there's no way he, he lifted him in there. No, I think he just shut the trunk just to shut it. I don't uh -huh. know. Okay. You're free to go. Can I see Mr. Kusno? Oh, no, we think he killed his girlfriend, so he's staying here with us. Oh, boy. How was your audition? Oh, uh, it was... I'm really anime. just asking. I don't need an answer. Come on, we're in the middle of tech. Jesus. <laughs> Imagine doing that to, uh, to your wife, Josh, asking her about something and then saying, Oh, I don't really care. That would not just, go just well. Try, just try it. You know what? Get her on the phone. This is not what her contract was supposed to say. Maybe something. All right. Are they all going to be terrible? Is anyone going to be redeeming? Forgotten. Forgotten. Nine, eight, <laughs> seven. Do a fucking slam poetry. I'm so excited. Oh. <laughs> you know, seems like. Is he going to try to change sides and use them? You and Hank, that's still a fit, man. I'm so sorry, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> okay, can we just say that once and for all? Look, I love you, man. And Come on, let's celebrate. And to think, Fuchs only did this probably so he became a bigger army to fight Barrio with. <laughs> True, yeah. Send somebody to Ralph's, get sandwiches, and uh, you know, a case of Rolling Rock. Let's do it all. Rolling Rock. <laughs> all right, you guys clearly don't get this. So to re Oh, no. This? It's walking down this? It was seen by her. Uh. Barry. Oh my god, are you okay? Do you mean that? Do you mean that, Sally? Do you care? She's only wants him to be okay so that he can perform <laughs> in their thing. Two, great. One, one, two, three. Come on. Why do you need to practice that? Oh my god. Oh god. I didn't like it. it was embarrassing. You look like a fucking whore. Don't be an idiot. Don't fucking call me an idiot. I'll call you a fucking idiot. Yeah, and you know what else? I'll talk to who I please, when I please. You don't own me, you fucking prick. How dare you? Wow, way to fuck over your scene partner. Tell me what happened. I just, I don't know, I saw all those people. I just, I kind of panicked. So I got out there and I... I... She didn't have the courage. 
My husband and I thought you were amazing. There she is. That was breathtaking. Because <sighs> people don't want the truth. Mr. Kusino, you're free to go. What happened? I, I guess they found this thing in Janice's trunk. So this translates to the debt has been paid? I'm guessing that the pin was the one that Hank gave him and that's what he threw in that trunk. Not the right thing to text him. Oh, fuck. Barry Black is dead. Berkman's coming. <laughs> he is dead! Shit! There? They were really short because they're Bolivians. <laughs> oh my fucking word, he is unhinged. Yeah! Duke, you fuck! Oh, this teacher versus a student. That was fast. Oh my god. He was like, oh, it's Barry, it's fine, and he just fucking kills him. Fuck! Oh my god. I don't know, is he coming too? He didn't even notice at first that it was him. Blind rage. What did he whisper? Directed by Bill Hader. <laughs> Whew. Oh my god. That was a lot. Okay. Um, so finally, you are on the same page as me. We have now watched the same amount of Barry. <laughs> we are finally an equal level playing level. And all you have to do is catch up on six seasons of Clone Wars, and a season of The Bad Batch, and two seasons of The Mandalorian, and we'll be on the same level there. But for now, on this, I'm on, we're on the same level. I'm on your level. Yep. Oh, my God. Um, wow, I mean, I, I, I'll just give it to you, just your pure initial thoughts after how the end of all, that uh, that season there. Not even just the end of the season. I think I have to say the end of, you know, the series. I mean, not the end of the series, but the end of the two seasons. And it's like, what a refreshing breath of fresh air in terms of, a story narrative and weird interesting characters and fucked up plot lines and like anything that can go wrong can and it, it's like all these tangled webs of crazy shit happening it's like it's it, people talk about their shows like every people talk about lost people talk about the sopranos this you know where it's like it, it's its own genre of like this is something else and like this feels like the most underrated form of that, in my opinion, like the fact that more people aren't watching this, that, you know, that in real life, I think you're the only one who I know watches it. Maybe, maybe our buddy Nick, but it's like, this is, this is good, man. For, for the, for its runtime and story. This is, this is great. And whoo, but, uh, the recap, the last two episodes, Barry, man, he's, He's off the deep end. Like, that last massacre was like, holy fucking shit. And now Gene knows. I'll, <laughs> I'll, I'll let you take the reins from here. It's, yeah. it's so much to take in. Um, I think, first, just to summarize the last two episodes, uh, they were good. I wouldn't say they were like the best episodes of the show or anything. They were good episodes. Um, I think overall, when when I think about the two seasons, like I said before, uh, before I think in the last episode, we uh, last video we did, the second season I'm pretty sure I binged all in one day, so I didn't really get a chance to really take it in. And so rewatching it again over the last couple of weeks, you know, it is better than I remember. And I think the difference between them is I think the first season is is a little bit better when it comes to like the whole season a coherent story and meeting Barry and meeting these characters. It's just a really good season. This one, I think 
what the highlight for me is just the the moments, like the high key moments in the season from the ending there with Gene uh, and the whole Barry going through that whole house and massacring everybody. The stuff on stage with Sally and her at the last second, not having the courage to pull the trigger and be vulnerable with the audience. But then that end up being what the audience liked because they don't want, you know, the truth, the rawness. They just want to be, you know, feel good about it. Um, and that's kind of a hard truth that she's going to have to face. And then moments earlier in the season, like the fifth episode, which I think is the best episode thus far of the show. Um, and a few other moments that I thought really just are incredible. Um, but yeah, the ending there, I think it's a, obviously a cliffhanger ending. Who knows what's going to happen? Um, season three is out. It's almost over as we record this. So we're going to get into that, but, um, it's going to be nuts to see this came out in 2019. So it's been, you know, three years, basically kind of the same situation as like stranger things. So it's like the characters I'm sure are going to look different and there's going to be a lot of development. I don't know how much of a time jump there is, but I'm just very, very excited. Um, Sally sucks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we can both agree on that. Not the actor, but <laughs> the character. The, the actor the actor is giving the writing and, you know, the portrayal a perfect a perfect performance. It's just that sh- the character sucks. It's like, "Oh my god, like I can't imagine saying anything to of what she says to a significant other who might be in the same career or even like my f- friends in acting." I said, uh, oh, you, know, you haven't been acting longer. You got this all day. It's like, be happy for him. It's like, oh, my. I mean, I get it. You're under a lot of pressure, but it's like, push that shit in. But whatever. I can rant about Sally all day. <laughs> Is that, I guess we'll just leave it there. I mean, there's so much we could probably say, but um, we'll, we're going to move on because the show is not over. There's more that just came out that we're going to watch. So make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't so you can watch Barry Season 3 with us, as well as all the other stuff we're watching here on the channel and become part of the target audience. Absolutely. Thank you guys so much for coming along on this journey with us. I'm Alex. This is Josh. We are the target audience where content is made for absolutely everybody, but we think it's specifically made for us and hopefully for you as well. Thanks again. See you in the next one.